you something, and I think you'll agree with me. Mall parking is the worst part of holidays. It is, and I talk about it every year because it never gets better, like your drunk uncle. This, this is true. There are people still out there looking for a parking spot from two Christmases ago. They're driving around tired and hungry and confused. What year is it? I hope there's some Furbies left on the shelves. Uh, <laughs> Finding a parking spot at the mall is impossible. We have all had this happen. You think you found a space, and then all of a sudden you get close to it, and you're so excited you go to pull in, and there's a teeny tiny little smart car in there. And you would get mad, but they're so cute. They're like a, little, like a car had a baby car, like a little tiny baby car. So you, you try to stalk people and look for uh, somebody leaving. So you follow somebody walking to their car, and they get to the car, and again, hopeful, and then they're like, oh, I'm not leaving. And you smile and wave because we should be kind to one another. But in your heart, in your head, you're thinking, I hope you have a bad Christmas. Why are they going to their car if they're not leaving? It's a mall. It's not like it's convenient to walk back to your car. There should be a rule. If you go back to your car, you must leave. You, and if you want to go back inside, you have to drive around, find a new spot. That's what happens. The four of us agree. Now, when you finally find somebody leaving, that's a family of, like, 19 kids. That's... That family tries to get into a car. It's not pretty. The, the parents see you waiting, and they warn you. They're like, this is going to take a while. And you're like, I don't care. I see a spot, and I'm waiting. And then the, each kid takes about five minutes to strap. And it's like the parents have never strapped a kid in before. And if you do the math, that's five minutes, 19 kids. Do, they, New Year's Eve, you get that place. Some malls are trying to make the process better. Like, some malls have a shuttle now. Have you seen this? Here's how it works. You park in another parking lot, even further from the mall, and then you wait in line for a shuttle, and then they drive you to the real parking lot, and then you walk to the mall, and then you wait in line for 40 minutes at Victoria's Secret, and then you walk out and you get back in line waiting for the shuttle again, and then they drive you back to the other parking lot, and you walk back to your car, and then you can't back out for 20 minutes because there are cars lined up behind you trying to get out of the mall. And that's why this is the last year I'm getting my mother something from Victoria's Secret.